Like, yeah, come on. I understand you're a young you're a young man. But why don't you believe that you can do anything else but rap? Bro, because that school shit is dead as shit, bro. I didn't say you have to go to school. That shit boring as fuck. Like, come on now, bro. You have the whole internet in your hands. You can learn stuff online without going to school. But I'm nice at rapping, though. I'm nice. But what if it doesn't work? But it's going to work, though. There's what if... No but, okay. No let's just... Let's, pre- let's be in a world and pretend rap doesn't work. What would you do now? I'm going to keep hustling. Okay. that If you're talking about that kind of stuff, that can land you in jail. Okay. What are you going to do now? You go to prison, do your shit time, get out, keep doing your shit, bro. To go back to prison? Yeah. Why do you feel like that's the only route out? Why don't you feel like bro, there's nothing else you can do? Well, come on, bro. You can't beat this shit, though. You can't beat, you can't beat this shit, though. You, you know that, too. You know personally. You cannot, as a black person, you cannot beat this shit. No, this, no, 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 talk, no. Talk. It's better than making, like, $9 an hour at McDonald's, $10 an hour, bro. I'm not working 12 hours, bro. I'm not doing that shit, bro. I'm not working on McDonald's, no fast food, bro. What do you have you against people who work in McDonald's? Nigga, I'm not being paid nine dollars an hour, bro. Like, come on, bro. I'm worth more than nine dollars an hour. And right. I deal with fucking You're seventeen. Shit, okay. You, what's wrong with starting at nine dollars an hour and learning some customers, customers, customer service because skills I'm used that can to help you? I'm not myself money like that, though. You understand? Like, yeah, I've been, but... been hustling since I was 13, 14, bro. Like, you understand that? I'm, I, I make more than niggas from McDonald's, bro. Why am I? Why would I take less? Because fast money ends you up where? Bro, I've been doing this since I was 13, though. You don't think your luck's going to run out? You got to do the time, bro. So you'd rather do this, go to prison, than just take some time to learn to earn money the slow way and then eventually be able to build your craft and then teach other young black men like yourself that they don't have to just go into rap or entrepreneur selling? Why can't, why can't you be bigger than that? Because, bro, we've made in a society that we're not going to be bigger than that, though. You guys understand that. Do you live with they your parents? See, they, they don't want niggas to see out here, though. You guys understand that. Do you live with I your parents? Know, let me talk. Can I talk? Can I talk? Have you ever been in my situation? You don't yeah. know my situation. So how you gonna make me seem like it's easy to get a job at McDonald's, bro? Like, niggas need, like, what the fuck McDonald's gonna do with me? You're not gonna do shit for me. You're 17. Okay, what the fuck can I do? Plus, right. taxes taken out. Taxes taken out, bro. You be a broke-ass nigga. Okay, so are you living currently? Are you living at your parents' house? No. So that's your apartment? Yes. You pay the rent and everything? Yes. Where'd you live before you lived there? My parents' house. How did they provide a house for you? They got a job. Oh, they have a job? Yes, they, they, they work 12 hours, bro. It's still poor, bro. They barely make the rent, bro. Like, like who want to live like that shit, though? Who want to live that type of life? Think about How that. disrespectful is that, though? Your parents just, put a house, a uh, roof over your head, and you're going to call them poor? Okay. Why don't you have any respect for your parents? I never said that. I do have respect. You just said they're working 12 hours and they're poor. But it's true, though. What is poor to you? No, 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 no. Come on, bro. I, I told her my husband since I was 13, bro. I took care of myself, bro. They have no money to support me, bro. I've been doing this to myself. You understand that? You understand that? I've been taking care of myself, man. Like, So you had no food at the house? They provided no food. Nigga, nigga barely have money to pay the rent, bro. Like, you understand that? You don't know, you, you? You don't know my situation. Okay, but they were still trying their best. Okay. So why are you saying that them trying their best, working twelve so hours a day, me, me to make sure right? you... I'm not gonna let them make me starve though. I got, I got out there. My niggas play the game. I help them make money, bro. Yeah, but that kind of stuff ends you up in jail or dead. Okay. So, so what's it? What's it all for? What's it all for? If hold on, what what's it all for? If you're gonna die, huh? What's it all for? If you're gonna die or end up in prison? We say, what is it all for? If you're gonna die and end up in prison, is money that important? Yes, this is, bro. So when so, you ta- so you say money not important? No. So, so okay, you do cybersecurity, right? So you do that shit for free? No. How much pay your bills though? You can't pay your bills, bro. But see, I don't do stuff. I don't do stuff that's gonna end me up in jail or dead. Okay, but like you have the easy way out though. Niggas don't have the easy way out, bro. Like, come on, now. I don't How have time to the easy way out. Niggas trying to get some niggas making money, bro. Nigga, making the money, pay your shit, bro. Move on. 
Ha- the whole do- world get rich, bro. Okay, do-, rich. do you have enough money right now to pay your rent for an entire year? No. Okay, do you have enough money to pay your rent for the next six months? The next five months, yeah. Okay, so why don't you do that? Go get a job, and then go from there. You've already you're already ahead. Why don't you get out now? <laughs> why would I get a job if I'm making good money though? Because that'll end you up in jail or dead. Okay, and do you not value your life? But that that's the life that no, you grew up in. Come on, bro. Like, come on. Do you value your life? Well, I value, yes, I do value my life. I can't tell. You just said it's fine if you end up in jail or dead. It's okay though. What do you mean? It's normal, right? It's normal. It's just normal. Going to jail or dying is normal. For it's, who? It's, it's normal though. For who? It's normal. Like, like don't you know you know people who are dead, right? People die around you, right? Uh, I don't know a lot of people who are dying being entrepreneurs. But but think about it. You don't know my life though. You know, nigga, I know niggas that die for this shit, bro. So when are you, you look at are, that, are you I happy with that? Are you happy? They're not letting me talk though. They can't let me talk. Bro, I know niggas that what's name been doing this shit when I was younger, bro. Nigga dialed this shit. Nigga with the jail, bro. Like, come on, man. Like, like, what, what do we have? What do you mean, us? Like, like, what do you? As a black person, bro. As a black man, bro. You can't do shit. You'll be working for the white man for the rest of your life, bro. I'm in my own money, bro. Fuck all that shit, bro. You understand that? Fuck you think, all that shit. You think selling? You think black men dying and going to jail is not what the white man wants? But what else do we have, though? That's not what I ask. In my environment. Niggas, this is what niggas do, bro. No, I'm just saying, if you think... No, 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 I, I lost my little man, bro, when I was 13, bro. Like, come on, man. Like, okay. Like, so you think... I'm, I, I'm not necessarily agreeing with you, but you, are you saying that if the white man could dream of a perfect way to put down the black man, it would be to get him to sell stuff to his own people, them die off of that stuff, and then the person who's selling dies or goes to prison? Do you think that's what the white man would dream of? The whole point is getting rich to really move, get out of the hood, though. That's the whole thing. Well, that's what I asked you. Get out of the hood, get, get your parents out of the hood. That's the, that's my goal, to get rich get out of the hood, bro. That's all I want, bro. So you have a plan. I can't get rich work at McDonald's, though. Am I right or am I wrong? No, I, I respect people who work at McDonald's. What you say? I respect people who work at, man, that work at McDonald's. You're, you're silly, though. It's goofy. No, because I don't want my brothers out here dying on the streets. But think that's what my, matters. If I get rich, right? Move, I get out of the hood. My friend, my family got out of the hood, bro. That's why they live, watch over our backs no more, bro. You have, you have to understand that. The whole point of getting rich, get that out, get that out of here, bro. So you're you're willing to kill our other young black men and kill yourself to do that? Die trying getting rich, bro. Get rich, die trying, man. And that's why they people say money can be the root of all evil. So so you go when you go to work, right? What what is your what's in your primary focus? What do you want to do? My primary focus is take care of my family. By getting the money, your paycheck, right? Yeah, but see I don't sell poison to our young brothers. What do you mean selling poison, nigga? Uh, they don't have to come to me though. They chose to come up to me though. They I don't I don't have to I don't force none of it. And that's exactly what's wrong with the mindset. We have more that's black true. we got more black brothers taking more black brothers, and then you turn around and say, well, it's the white man. But it's the white man, though. The white man made society to see for them, not for the black people, though. So, how are black men billionaires if white people are just taking it all over? They had to hustle and grind for that shit. They're not boring that shit, though. Think about it, think about it. When I get rich, right, my child, my offspring, bro, you don't have to worry about none of this shit, though. You don't have to go through this shit. That You'll be go, dead right? or in prison. What do you mean, offspring? He's gonna okay. grow up. You're gonna get. Rich, what are you gonna he, do? Go. I get, I get the money. He'll be a rich nigga. The whole point is you have a better life for your little child. Okay. Okay. So you go get a woman pregnant, and you end up dead or in jail, and then we have another black boy who grows up without a father. When and then that's why we have our black boys right now reading at a fourth grade level, the lowest in any race in this town, because so many black men grow up without fathers because they have so many black fathers like you who want to get rich or die trying, but they end up dying trying. But but they, but they don't. But, but she they don't. She don't have to worry about it, bro. She got the money, bro. She have, she can afford the schooling for it, bro. You gotta understand that nigga. It's all about what you do for your offspring, bro. Like, come on now, you won't die for your offspring. That you basically told so me. So money is more money is more important than the kid having a father. Bro, yes it is. So they can have a better life than I do, bro. How'd they get a better life than you did? You're gone. 
bro, when they get the money, the she know the wife know what to do. They what she went through, I went through. She wasn't gonna make sure he have to grow up like that. Okay, so you think your your son is gonna be proud to be like, so what happened to your dad? Oh, he <coughs> he he died selling. That's it. <laughs> okay. That's not something a son would be a proud of. But he got the money though. He got the bread to be successful in his own way, right? Okay, and let me ask you a question. Then. You have the option to be anything, bro. You don't have to worry about nothing, bro. You so if that. if your father got money selling little girls, would you be okay with that? <laughs> bro, what the fuck? <laughs> you said it's only about money. <laughs> what the fuck wrong with you, bro? Exactly. You see how crazy that sounds? But my son little girls though, like, come on now. <laughs> <laughs> Just selling poison that's killing your black brothers. That sounds even crazier to me. That's not my problem, though. They, they, exactly. They so if your father said the same thing about selling children and said, it's not my problem, I didn't ask them to buy the children. <laughs> They're buying them on their own. Okay, okay, okay. I have a question for you, though. I have a question for you. You grew up in a two-parent household, right? I did. You got a silver pie on you, bro. Like, you ate out of a silver spoon. Who said that? You have to hustle, bro. You got to do none of that shit. When you was 13, 14, 15, you have a normal childhood, high school, right? You have to deal with no boy, no one dying, no one going to jail, bro. You let like, come on, bro. Like, you, you don't understand. And why guess I'm what? And that job. all happened when my father went to a regular job, not selling anything. But but I have a question though. You, parents, put my, you grew up on a silver pla- on a silver platter, bro. No, your parents did the same thing. They worked no, as hard as they could, but you said they're poor. My mom's a single mom. What do you mean, though? What do you mean? I got grown up. Oh, bro. your mother's a single mom? <laughs> yes, bro. Wow. So what, ha- so what happened to your father? He's in prison. right? Oh, there. wow. And there you go, people. Your father's in prison. Why? Huh? Why is your father in prison? Bro, why are you being too feral, though? Like, he did no, some no, no, shit. You got to tell me if <laughs> You got to tell me everything. <clears throat> Was he an entrepreneur too? No. He wasn't an entrepreneur. He got caught. He got caught in the charges. He got caught up being yeah. out there in that life. He had to hustle. <laughs> yeah. Oh. He provided though. He provided though. He. Pro- you just said you were poor. He provided though. He did what he did. Then got locked up. Then boom. And then you grew up poor. Yes, because my mom was on push raise me. Because your father wasn't there. Yes. <laughs> so you just told me that if you went to prison, as long as your kids got the money, it's fine. But what if you, he, he, your he father, what if your father thought the same thing and y'all grew up poor? Okay. So but what is keeping you? Though. It's different though. I would keep my word, bro. That's a but it's different between me and him though. I would keep my word no matter what though. You're 17, man. Okay. If you got a girl pregnant right now and went to prison next year, they be done for. You know that, right? No, they're not, bro. How are they not? Are you going to make that much money in a year? Then, but they're not, though. That's a problem. Though. A problem is they're not, though. Why do you think that? Why do you think you're the lucky one? What do you mean I'm the lucky one? You're you're making it seem as if you can't go to prison and leave a you child know, without his father. Like, you don't know why I did, though. That's the problem. I don't, don't know, know why, why you did? did though. You, don't, you don't know why I did, though. Why you went to prison? Well, you don't know why I did, though. You said I'm the lucky one, bro, but you don't know why I did, though. No, I'm saying, why do you think you're the lucky one who's not going to end up in prison or in the grave? I'm not, though. That's a problem. Like, why do you think I'm that? Smart. I move smart. I move smart. You're smart. I move smart. You think this is the smart way to move? What do you mean? Am I, did I, ever, I never went to jail, never got questioned. No one never came up to me. How old was your father when he went to prison? Huh? How old was your dad when he went to prison? I don't know. You don't like, even. He went to prison when I was like, when I was like two. 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 Was two. he seventeen? Huh? Was he seventeen? No, he was, I think he was like in early, late mid thirties or some shit. So you don't think that could happen to you in your mid thirties? No, because I'll be rich by then. What do you mean? <laughs> like, what do you mean though? What? Do you, what, <laughs> what do you mean? And what do you learn? Where did you learn all that from? Can I ask you? Where did you learn that? Being an entrepreneur selling is gonna make you rich. The and, streets, bro. I, I said like the, rapping, the rapping shit gonna blow me up though. I've never said that. The shit going the, the the entrepreneur shit is just gonna get me going, but the rapping shit gonna blow me up though. How many rappers do you think make it? Like a, just give me a percent. How many rappers do you think make millions of dollars? 
A percent. All, out of all, all the rappers niggas, there are. But all my niggas from my hood, bro, they made out, though. That's not what I asked. I said, out of all the they, rappers, they out, what percent? Oh, so all your people made it out the hood. Yeah, but, but like, they got locked up with some charges, but, like, when they get out, but they popping, though. They pop on my block. But they're locked up? Yeah. So are they making millions? Locked up? They got money for their past vids. But they're locked up. Yeah. So there's nothing that money can do for them now. Support their families. What do you mean? That, that's the only, that's the that's the goal of for supporting your family. Well, how's your rap career gonna take off if you get locked up? Bro, it's not that hard to blow up in rap, bro. It's not? It's how, really not. Okay, well then how many rappers in, in New York it's not that hard, bro. All you have to do is what's saying this someone dead, bro, then you you up there. Okay, so what percentage of rappers do you think are successful? Everybody, nigga, n- niggas in New York, bro, hey, bro. Come on, bro. I'm, I told you, bro. All I have to do is this someone dead, bro. Then boom, you blew up, or you started beef between someone, or just beef with a nigga. Yo, just beef with That's, a nigga. In New York. Okay, so can I? I'm, I'm gonna get into what you just said. Can you let me know what percentage do you think is successful? Ten percent, twenty percent. That we mean by successful, like currently not locked up with no charges. No, what, what, whatever you consider successful. Like, like, what do you mean? When you get signed, you're successful, right? You got signed to a deal. Yeah, I'm going off your definition of success. Let's oh, go off that. <laughs> but anyone can get signed, though. Okay, so what? Okay, so you think if a rapper just gets signed, he's successful, or yes. she's successful? Yes. So all the rappers who have been signed to labels who went flat broke were they successful? We said all the rappers who have gotten signed and are now broke are they successful? But my niggas wasn't broke. I'm talking about I, my, my perspective. My niggas, bro. Them niggas not broke. But you said any rapper who gets signed. Yes, nigga. I'm talking about in New York, though. Niggas from New York, bro. So, I'm talking like, about New York in general, bro. New York. New York yes. City. Biggest biggest city in the world. I mean, in yes. the United States. You think all of them that say, I'm going to rap are successful. Yes. All you have to do is this one dance, this one block, then you up there, though. Okay, so the so people like that shit though. Where where is all these millions coming from? If everybody who says I'm gonna rap and this is set, it's immediately successful. Niggas in jail though. That's the problem. Niggas get locked up. That's the reason why she's not jump, not not pumping. So what's the point of doing it then? If everybody who does it says they're gonna be successful, only get locked up. Why do it? To get the money, bro. The fast money. There's bro. no there, support there's, the family. That's all it no, matters. There's no family. money. You say they literally get locked up before they blow up. You said they get locked up niggas before. Get niggas get no. Niggas get signed. Niggas drop a little couple music video. Then niggas get locked up, bro. On some pay shit. Okay, so all your friends who made all this money, you're living in what? Is that a two bedroom apartment? It's a three. Three bedroom apartment. Why haven't they give you any money? Because I don't ask for shit, bro. When niggas, bro, niggas were out, they got me. When they get out, they got you? No, when they was out, though. Like, before before they got locked up. So so you still have to go out here and be an entrepreneur and sell with all these homies around you making millions? But I'm not leeching off no other, another nigga, though. Like, what the fuck do I like leech off Okay, but nigga? I thought it was about helping each other. You said it's about getting money and helping That's each other. helping by features, by putting them on, sharing this shit, bro. That wasn't about helping, so you can blow yourself your own self. So your brother, who is supposed to get in the rap, help all these people, he'd rather have you out on the street selling so you can end up dead or in jail? The nigga's locked up. What do I, what, what can he do? He wasn't locked up to begin with. Okay. I don't understand. Listen, I really don't understand why you think your outcome is going to be different. If but, but all your friends get locked it's up, not gonna happen. But when niggas, okay, niggas will be free twenty twenty four, right? Boom, boom, like boom. You start grinding the music, shit, bro. You gonna, you gonna hear my name, bro? I don't think so. You don't think so? You know why? Why? Because <laughs> you just told me all of your friends get locked up. They coming out twenty twenty four, bro. I'm telling you, they'll just like, get like, locked up again, <laughs> don't they? <laughs> no nigga bro nigga, God said niggas change bro God understand niggas focus how, how they change you just said you told me earlier I said if you go to prison you said it's all good and I said what if you go back to prison you said it's all good so you just said you would but get out and go happen, right though. back niggas change niggas no niggas be in prison one time niggas want when niggas get out niggas change big money bro the whole gonna make money bro 
How do they you change? Think, bro. bro, you think going to jail is cool, bro? Going to jail is not cool. You make it sound cool. You just said you're fine with going to prison. How am I making it sound cool? Because I asked you. Bro, I'm not going to bitch about anybody. If I go to prison right now, tomorrow, I'm not going to bitch about it, bro. Just do your time, bro. Get out. Then start back grinding, bro. That, that all it is, though. Exactly. You see how that sounds? You know what? Yeah. I'm just going to go to prison. It's all good. And you even said you'd be fine with dying and leaving your son with no father. Okay. You make it sound like that's cool then. I'm not making it sound cool. I'm just the reality, <laughs> nigga. This is the reality, nigga. Like, no, it doesn't. Like, it doesn't have to be, though. You make that your reality because you want to get out here and be an entrepreneur. Bro, it's, you think I do that full time, nigga? I told you I rap, nigga. Not listen to me, bro. Brother. <laughs> Brother. This rap career that you're talking about. Okay. If it's that on and popping, why are you still selling? <laughs> bro, because the shit is dead right now. Yeah. Why? Because n- niggas are locked up. Like I said before, you're not listening to me, bro. Niggas are locked up. I thought you okay, you can't use money to go pay for okay, 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 okay. Let me talk and talk. You gotta say music in New York, right? You don't have to be good at music, bro. It's about the politics about this shit, bro. You gotta understand. Like this one nigga, right? Nigga, his brother died, bro. Nigga start jumping, bro. That always is the politics, bro. Guys, are y'all hearing this? This man is talking about people dying, people going to prison, and you keep talking about this rap career that obviously nobody can succeed at because they all get locked up or die. Right? Has is there any person you know right now who is currently rapping who is not locked up? Yeah. Okay. Is he big? Yeah. He's making millions. Yeah. And everybody knows who he is. Yeah. In America. Yeah. What's his name? Kenzo B. Kenzo B. Everybody <laughs> yeah. knows who that is. Yes. Guys, have y'all ever heard of Kenzo B? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> exactly. And how do you know he's making millions? You seen his W2? <laughs> dick and I'm not on the dick a dick, bro. Like, you see, like, y'all, y'all be dicky. Well, how do you know he makes millions? Did he just tell you that? We said. How do you know he makes millions? Bro, the nigga look. Bro, nigga, nigga, I don't. Nigga, he, he no. make money, bro. <laughs> you said millions. How do you know he makes millions? <laughs> Yo, what the fuck? Yo, he funny as shit, bro. He funny. But like, think about it. how I'm supposed to do that. Though? I'm not on this nigga dick though. I know he so makes money think. for doing what he do. So you don't even know how much he makes. We said. You don't know how much he makes. No. So if he makes a thousand dollars a month, you wouldn't know. How do you know he has money? <laughs> How do you know anything? He good. He eat good. What's good? Where's he eating good? He's just eating good. So he's got what a three bedroom house. No. Do you know where he lives? Do you know anything about him? <laughs> you don't even know where he lives, so you don't hang out with him or talk to bro, him. Bro, bro, what the fuck? You bro, said he's bro. your friend. That's not my friend. I never. You said a nigga in New York. You literally said, bro. You just I, you said a nigga in New York. Name I said a nigga in New York. I said, do you know anybody who is successful and not locked up? You said yes. yes. Nigga, you said a nigga in New York, though. I just named a nigga in New York. But you don't know him. Okay. You know of him. That's different. I said, do you, somebody you know that's not locked up? Oh, from? Huh? Are you serious? Yes, there anybody you know that's not locked up that's successful rapping that you know personally? No, okay, that's what I thought. Exactly, exactly. So you don't know, you don't know anybody successful, right? But I have a question though, because me. So so what do you get out of this though? What do you get out of this? Uh, saving another black man's life. What do you mean though? I don't want to see you dead, brother, or in prison. But where? I'm not gonna be dead. That that's what all of y'all say. So do you think I'm? You just said your brother. You said you have brothers dying who are locked up. So how are you gonna tell me different? So you saying that I'll I'll be like that? Yes. If you don't change, you ain't special. Say I'm special, bro. You're not, bro. So you saying all the bad things I do gonna catch up to me one day? Of course. Then I'll be ready for the consequence. Simple. But why not change now? Bro, honestly, bro, one day... I think you your life's meet, valuable. But one day you meet your day, though. Mm, you don't have to meet it like this. 
You gotta understand that one day you meet your day. You can't live a life as a sinner, bro. One day you meet your maker, bro. That's how you want to meet your maker. You gotta understand that. You could do so much better. You say you got enough money to help you for five months. Go do something with your life. I'm not saying you gotta go make. You just go do something else. Anything else. Bro, I, I won't, don't work at McDonald's, nigga. Bro. Why does it have to be McDonald's? Why do you have to keep going to McDonald's? There's other jobs. You can go be a plumber. Like what? Like what? You can go be a plumber apprentice. Oh, for real? Yeah. And in New York, I, I don't know how much they make in New York, but I know men who are plumber apprentices that are in their 20s making $75,000 a year. Blue collar you can't work. do that? Blue collar work. Huh? Blue collar work. Yes. Bro, That's I, something respectable. So you respect niggas like that? Why wouldn't I? Look at your house. Who do you think that was built by? Blue collar okay. people. Right? The clothes you wear on your back, that bed you keep sitting on, that, that chair. Look at the roads you drive on. Who do you think made all that happen? Just average men living average lives. So you think I can do that? Why couldn't you? It, it's just like, I don't, I, don't, I don't see like, I don't see me doing shit like that. Why? It's not, it, it, that's down bad though. Like, imagine your nigga seeing, oh, dude, look at you, bro. Why? What do you mean, old dudes? Like, m- why my niggas see me like that though? Who cares? They're dead or bad. in jail. They're down bad, bro. That's down bad. Your your friends are locked up. What are you talking about? What are they gonna see? So when the niggas get out, bro, they say you doing this shit working at nine to five. Like, damn, bro, like, what I'm supposed to say? <laughs> uh, I don't want to be locked up or dead. So you say a job can keep you out of jail? Yes. <laughs> of course. <laughs> So you're saying because I prioritize, prioritize my job, I can just think, I don't think about the other stuff because I'll be busy focusing on my job. Yes. I don't understand. You. I don't think you understand how much money you can make as a blue collar worker. If you just put your head down for about 10 years, you can come up easily making six figures. Easily. So I'll be, I'll be like, let me see, I'll be like 27. So I'll be 27, 28. And you won't be dead or in jail. So live a normal life. Yes. It's just like, I could, but like, who, it, it's not me, though. You know what I'm saying? What is, why is that not you, though? <laughs> it's not me, though. Why? Well, because, like, think Your about fa- it. Huh? Think about it, though. It's like, that's down bad. It's like down bad. How is that like, down bad? You're making money legally. You know, that shit, too, either. Huh? No female, no, no female will jack you, bro. If, you see, if a female see me, who well, cares you about that shit? Who cares about a woman? I promise you, you're not going to have no women in jail. But we got to say, you know, bitches have fetishes and shit about that. So? They have fetishes at home in their bedroom while you're still in jail, alone. Bro, I'll be with the bros, though. That's something you're happy with, being with the bros in jail? You know what happens in the jail? (laughs) Bro, no one's not going to touch me, bro. Like, like, that shit's just rumors, though. Uh, No, it's not. And niggas don't be like that, though. Y'all understand that. Oh, they like that. They gonna find somebody. Bro, nigga, I went to juvie, bro. Like, like niggas never not like that. You, that. listen, you won't, you won't work a blue jolly job because you think the women won't be on you, right? It, no, no, it's not that. It's just like, that's just down, down bad, though. Like, when we grow up, we see niggas like that, we just laugh at them niggas, bro. Why? Like, niggas have to wake up at 9 o'clock in the morning to do some the white man bidding. You're doing My the white man's bidding? You're, yeah, you're, man. No, you're doing the white man's bidding because you're literally yeah, dying and going to jail. Overall? I think that's if you if this white man you keep talking about, if there's anything he wants to see, you dead. But why is that though? What do you mean? Why is that? You just make you make it seem like the white man wants the black people to be gone. So the best thing to do is get somebody like you to go sell poison to our brothers, kill them off, have you either dead or in jail. It's a win win for everybody. Right? Mm-hmm. If I was a white man and I was racist, that's exactly what I would do. I would just get brothers like you to believe that you can go be a rapper or sell or be an entrepreneur, go sell, kill your brothers, and then I want you dead and in jail. Perfect. Exactly how I wanted it. Okay, so so you're saying the white man like my niggas in jail and shit. Like they they see the niggas in rapping, niggas got locked up, the white man. And they like, laugh at y'all. But, but like think about that that's like the only way we get money though. 
No, it's not. That's just the way y'all think y'all can get money. And they and laugh I'm, at y'all. It's, it's hilarious. It, it, I mean, if I was really, if racism was really that big, but if I was a racist white guy, it would, I would love to see how y'all black people act. So, so you're saying, like, if I get packed up, right, you will laugh at me? I won't laugh at you. But if you're saying there's a white man out there waiting for you to fall, I'm sure he would laugh at you. But, That's, but, but a black man who goes out there and gets a legal job and makes legal money and takes care of his family, uh, I don't, I don't think that's a bad thing. Okay. I take care of my family. I just work a normal everyday job. I'm an average guy. You work hard, bro. You work, you've been doing the college shit, nigga. You've been doing all that other shit, nigga. You know how I was able to do that, though? Because my father was an average man, and he provided a house for us. And you would have laughed at my father, and I, I find that hilarious. Because I wouldn't have. <laughs> exactly. And, and it, you, you say all the money I'm making, and you would have laughed at my father because he provided this life for me. Instead of your life where you have no father... You have a Wait, single mother, and y'all were legacy. poor, and y'all were poor. He left a legacy, though. Your father left a peg. A pe- is your mother still poor? We say. Is your mother still poor? But she good though. She good. Is she I'm poor? Be saying some money on the side. That's not what I asked. I said, is she poor? But I don't know, bro. I, I'm gonna be in finances like that. You just said that you left because she was poor. You said that yeah, earlier. I left, I, no, I left because I got money to, for my own crib. That's the reason why I left. You said you had to hustle and everything because y'all were poor. Yes, for myself. She could take care of herself. So so y'all weren't poor? What? Were y'all poor or not? Yes, we was poor, bro. The reason why I hustled so I can take care of myself, so I can get the new shoes. They have money for the new shoes, but she didn't have money for the new shoes. So your father left a legacy where y'all couldn't even afford shoes. Damn. That's a legacy no, no, to live. I got the shoes though, right? I got the shoes. So it's, No, he didn't. Your father left a legacy where his son had to become an entrepreneur selling. That That is not a legacy that but he left. But that's what he did though. He did that for himself though. I <laughs> my age. And when, when he was my age, he did what he did. No, he didn't. He yes, left he y'all did. poor. And you had to go to the streets. Wow. Father of the year. <laughs> but it's better than, what's the name? Yours. Talk about... <laughs> How's it better than my father? My father's not in jail. Well, you might, you talk, we didn't go hustle for yourself, though. Teach you hustle for yourself, though. Because what your father did is why you have to hustle for yourself. That's the problem. You never have to hustle for yourself. You never grind because of what your father did, though, is why you had to hustle for yourself. If your father would have just worked the normal blue collar job, y'all have been fine. Who knows where you could be today? But now look at you. You're over here being an entrepreneur, selling. But if your father would have just worked the normal think- job. I give my mom some money on the low. I'm 17, nigga. Like, come on. Like, Look at this. Listen to this. Good job. Whoever his father is, good job. You made it to where your young child, who's 17 year old, has to take care of your ex baby mama. Congratulations. That, <laughs> that, that mama. is a legacy. That's the legacy I want to leave. I want to leave it to where my son has to take care of my ex wife or ex girlfriend or whatever she was. Did, did they marry each other? Yeah. Good, congratulations! You left your ex-wife to have her son take care of her. If that's not fucked up, I don't know what is. Bro, bro, what do you mean though? It's normal though. Like that's not normal. Is it? So, so is it normal? It's normal for a son to have to take care of his mother because his father went to prison. So who else going to take care of her though? But you, you said that's normal. But, How, no, but, uh, don't you give your mom money though? You take care of your mom, right? No. You don't you take care of your mom? My father takes care of my mother. Oh, bro, God. That's I, what I, men are supposed to do. I don't know where you come from. What, what am I doing though? I'm taking care of my mom. You're what not. Do you you're do? not her husband. You're her child. That's not the point. That's though. what's fucked up. You're the she son. Gave me housing, so I too gone. many, too many of our women today are having kids, and their sons are having to take care of them. That's fucked up. Your mom should have been with your husband. Should have been with her husband. But. You know what situation though, so like, how's that? I already know your situation. You told me your your father went to prison. But but you gotta understand that, like like so like so what can you do inside the pen, bro? Oh well, he could have avoided going to the pen. Why are you protecting your father so much? That's what I don't understand. Because uh, I'm not gonna let you diss someone, bro. You don't know that. You don't know the situation. You don't know what he's been through. Like, you don't know what he did. I'm not disrespecting your father, but what, it's it's because of what you, how you talk about him. You talk about like he did whatever he had to do, 
for y'all to grow up poor, and you're happy about yeah, that. Like, think about it. If he did have done what he done, I wouldn't be the person I am today, though. Y'all would still be poor. I don't see any difference of what you would have been like, different. It's a, I'm an investment, though. Think about it. You're not an investment. You're just another. Yes, you're just another we, black man who thinks he has to sell. We said you're another black man who grew up without a father. You're just another statistic. So, so if I be popping a rap and you be jamming my shit, I bet you be the first nigga jamming my shit. You say, "Hey, I know that nigga." You be popping my, you be playing my shit all around, bro. The other day you said, "Oh, he, I was wrong." The, yeah, move my mom out of her, move my move myself out of her, bro. She like, have a good life, bro. You, have to you think you, so? You think if you're a popping rapper that I'm gonna be like, yes, he made it. I know he probably um, sold a lot of poison to our black it's, brothers, it's, but he that, made it in rap. That's how niggas be nowadays, bro. Niggas disrespect with the hustle. Then when niggas really finally made it, bro, you be sucking a dick. That's how niggas be though. Is that how you think I'm gonna be? That how all niggas. I'm not saying you personally. I'm just saying everybody in general. Like your chat, bro. Your chat could be the same way. The chat, the chat, not agreeing what I'm doing, but you'd be the same people ten years later sucking my dick. You understand? No, it's just men like you get laughed at ten years from now. That's the problem. No, 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 no. They laugh at me now, but when niggas be popping, is okay. You know why they laugh? Why do they? Why do you think people would laugh at you? Why? Why do you think people would think you would fail? If everybody succeeds in rap, why do you think people think you're gonna fail? Because think about it, they think I'm another statistic, bro. They don't think I'm different. Thank you. Thank you. They think you're another statistic. Statistically, most people who rap don't make it, right? But they said niggas like me go to jail within five years from now, bro. That's what they said, though. Why? Why like, would? And why did those brothers go to jail? We said? Why do those brothers go to jail? Because of shit. The, the NYPD is corrupt, bro. You got to understand that. Niggas, the NYPD, NYPD corrupt, though. You know that, though. And you, you know that personally, though. Niggas be on your dick for no reason. Wait. Wait, you're not doing stuff that would, you know, get the police. But it's not about that though. NYPD be corrupt though. Like you know that too. You know personally though. You know personally as a black man, you know that shit. Chicago PD be corrupt. NYPD most corrupt, bro. What about you, as a black man? Are you corrupt? No, I'm, I'm chilling, nigga. Are I'm you? Just doing me. I'm tussling. You don't think it's corrupt to sell poison to our brothers? Yeah. Okay. okay. Never mind. Okay. Disregard that though. Disregard the poison. Disregard that shit. Uh-uh. Let's talk about NYPD though. Can we talk about NYPD? No. Niggas can be walking right. N- please pull right in front of you, bro. Check you for no reason. You're not walking that's right. Some fucked up shit, though, You're right? not doing anything uh, right. You gotta understand that's some fucked up shit, bro. You're not doing anything right. Niggas, you want niggas like me in jail, though, like, for no reason, though. That's the problem. You're selling poison they to people. They got the niggas like me for no reason, though. What do you mean, no reason? You sell poison. Niggas, come on. If niggas just walking down the street, you can't just pull up on a nigga to pat him down, then boom. You go, you're, you're locked up for a good two or three years, bro, like for no reason. But what that happened to you though? If you got locked up, would it be for a reason? Bro, exactly. I, 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 exactly. No, 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 no. You don't do stuff that can get you locked up. But I don't get caught with that shit. Though. That's a problem. My thing is, you said they would catch people for doing nothing. But what about you? Me personally. So you saying yes? You if personally. I walk down the street, right? Do you think NYPD will get me on that? No, they won't. Come out stupid. I don't keep that shit on me like that. Though. But what if they did though? What if they locked you up? Would you say? They got you on nothing. That's that's bullshit though. It's bullshit, right? Like, come on now. I'm just a regular black nigga. Why out all the niggas on the street? Why would you come after me though? Because you're an entrepreneur. What but they, they don't know that though. That's the problem. They don't know. You that. don't think they know? They don't know that though. You don't think they know? Come on, let's no, be honest no. with ourselves. They don't know that shit. Like, like niggas be like doing that shit. Like, yep. you, you understand? NYPD, NYPD's gangs, bro. Like, you understand? They worst, the worst of gangs, bro. Like, you can't beat fat, nigga. You cannot beat that shit. So you don't think they waiting for the day for you to slip up? That's that what they they play on my downfall. That what niggas they, they do, bro. You know that You're too. Down. As a black man, they do that shit. They, they be want niggas to slip up like that, bro. They want niggas to go to jail. They want niggas to be successful, bro. That's the problem. Why can't they just be successful, bro? Like, no one's not doing nothing to them. They just be only dick for no reason. You know that, though. NYPD's gangs, though. Tell your chat that. NYPD's gang, bro. What are your uh, chat saying? What are your chat saying right now, bro? They know NYPD is a gang. No. What they're constantly, what my chat is saying right now, or what they were saying, is that hopefully one day you get your life together. But that's not the problem, though. Yes, it is. But, but can you agree with me? That, that's gang activity, though. I don't if care about the police. You. I care about you. But, I want but, you to change. The police the problem, though. <laughs> like, come on now. You're doing stuff that would make the police 
get on your radar. No, no, no. If niggas just chilling, niggas just walking down the block, then you see five o on your dick, bro. Then boom, what would you do? You expect, bro? Niggas dial this shit, bro. So if so, if you were a plumber and you're just walking down the street, they just gonna throw you in jail for being a plumber? Yes, because I'm a black man. Look at this shit. Look at this shit. Ever I've carried this skin color, bro. And and that's how they get y'all. You don't believe in yourself at all. You just believe as long as you're black, you'll never make it. That's just what that's what this whole conversation is. Just because you're black, you have to do what you do. You'll never make it. Bro, I'm I'm trying to provide, bro. That's all I'm doing. Provide. provide for who? Well, my mom, bro. She had to make out. As long as she if she make out, bro, everybody be happy. Okay. Okay. So, when you, how long do you think it's gonna take to get you out the hood? Hmm. It's going to be a couple years, bro. So you got a couple years to pray to God that you don't go to jail within those next two years. Because yeah. if, if you go to jail, what's your mom going to do? I'll send the rest of my money then. How, how long is that money going to last? Okay, she, she have a job. so like, But you said she's she, dirt poor. She have, she worked 12 hours, bro. She, I, I think she can afford her rent, bro. No one don't live in the house, bro. I, I think she can manage that. So, you understand? I don't know because the way you make it sound like she's dead broke, all she can afford is rent, and that's it. Well, but but isn't that the main essential? Is your housing? I can't tell. When I mentioned that earlier, I said your mom provided a house for you. You told me, but she could only pay rent, and we were poor. I said she was doing the best she could, and you said, but it's not enough. That's what you said, and now you're but saying it's enough. Bro, I'm just saying, and that's perspective, bro. If I'm in jail, what what can I do, bro? Exactly, and your mom is gonna. Be, your mom will have nothing. Okay, then. So, like, so what, what were we arguing about there? You could have got. You can get a regular job and still help your mom. <laughs> if you really feel like you need to help your mom, which, and let me be honest with you, I don't feel like it's your. I don't feel like you have an obligation to help your mother. If that's what you choose to do, that's fine. But I hate that you're such a young man feeling like you have to provide for your mother because of what your father did. I, I, I can put on my back. I put the team on your back. Okay, well, get rid of that. Who's going to be there? Who's going to be there, though, when things get rough, when get heavy, though? Your mom. Is she? Right? When things get heavy, bro, when, when, niggas, when niggas looking for you, bro, who's who going to be there, though? So your if mom. your mom is going to be there for you, why is she letting you sell as an entrepreneur? She don't know that. She don't know that. Why haven't you told her? It's, well, you, that, you make it sound like you're so proud of it on here. You're telling the whole world. <laughs> Why can't you tell your mom? Yo, yo this is funny as shit. Why haven't you told her? Are you ashamed of it? Bro, why would I tell my mom that? Why haven't you? You said it's a good thing. You're providing. Why haven't you told her? Bro, because... Because you're ashamed of it. I'm not ashamed of it, bro. That's okay. stupid, bro. Would you tell your mom to sell, bro? Think about it. Ask that question to yourself. Would I tell my mama I sell? No, because I'd be ashamed of it. Exactly, nigga. So you're ashamed of it? I'm, I'm not admitting to it, bro. I'm not admitting to nothing, bro. I'm not admitting or denying nothing, bro. So why don't you tell her? I'm not telling her that shit, bro. That's just stupid, bro. Why is it stupid? Bro, she knows what I do, bro. She knows what I do with the other shit I be doing, bro. So, so she know. knows what you do. She's proud of that? No, no, no. What do you mean? I'm not doing nothing. The other thing I'm doing is not legal, though. But how did she... Oh, so your mom is... I'm gonna be honest. So your mom has no idea where all this extra money's coming from. Yeah, she she needs to go into my other hustle. Which is what? Bro, why are you being fed though? This not <laughs> like like they be fed. Or shit. No, you <laughs> said she doesn't know. So what does she think the money is coming from? From, from my my hustle, nigga. Yeah, but she doesn't know that you do that. So no, no, not that though. Not that not that hustle. The other hustle. Nigga. What's the legal hustle? Bro, you being fed, nigga. Why are you being fed, bro? You said you. You said it's legal, didn't you? How am I being a fed by asking you what are you legally bro, doing? I sell cars, bro. I sell cars, nigga. You sell cars? Okay. Why can't you do that full time? <laughs> because it's no money. Are you working for a car dealership? No. How do you sell cars? You flip them? <laughs> oh, oh, you're, oh, so you're still doing that kind of stuff, right? <laughs> You wild how shit. do you get how do you get the cars bro no, no exactly comment, no so no matter what you no matter what you're still being an entrepreneur right either way either way you cut it you're gonna end up in jail Yo, 
But what the heck? Yo, this shit might be a You said it was legal. You said it was legal. Yo, he's a he's a police. You oh, said shit. it was legal, but apparently it's not legal. You don't get these cars uh, from a dealership. That's all I'm don't saying. Comment. Don't comment. Don't comment. I, I yeah, talk. No, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. No so no matter what, you, so what did your mom think you do? She, she knows about the cars. I'm going to be honest. Is your mom just oblivious? She just think you get the cars from a dealership? I don't know. I don't know what she thinking. I just don't know. Do you that. talk to your mom about anything? What do you say? Do you talk to your mom about the money? What, what do you mean? When she says, son, where's this money coming from? You don't tell her nothing? My business. I said my business. So is your mom just that oblivious? She, bro, she's too busy worrying about her other shit, bro. Why, why does she have to? She's not going to question me, nigga. I'm the man in the house, nigga. I'm the man, bro. You don't even shit. live there. Okay, yeah, nigga, I'm the man though. Like, think about it. I'm that nigga's in jail. I'm the man now. So, like, you guys just said, when the money hit the table, it's all she cares about. That is sad. I would be sad it. to be a mom and not know how my son is providing for me. So, if your son give you some money, you would ask that nigga where the money comes from? Of course, from? I would. That shit weird though, think about it. You got money, bro. So, so shut the fuck up. I'm, I'm the parent. See, that's what I don't understand. You said I'm the man of the house. Uh, I've, she, 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 she's she your though. mom. You're not her dad. I'm just saying. You, do you understand that when you go down, right? Who's gonna be, who's the next person up? Your son. So she's still your mother. Okay then. Your son will take go handle the house, right? She can't even question you. She never questioned me though. I never said she couldn't though, but she never did. She, and that's sad. Do you understand that? The money. Move on my life. Yeah. So when she, I told her though, I told her business though, just business. I got the money for business. You've been doing this since you were thirteen. So you mean as a thirteen year old boy, you were going, yeah, mom, I got this from business. What the no, hell does that mean? I was doing the car thing while I was thirteen. Though I was not doing the car. Yes. Thing like so if you told her I'm getting it from business, and she didn't question you as a thirteen year old, don't you find that kind of weird? You're thirteen. You're not no damn man at thirteen. Sorry. <laughs> we had to step up, though. I stepped up the plate. At 13, she didn't even She question. probably knew. She probably knew, though. But, like, she still... You understand? She just let you get out there and ride, huh? But, you got to think about it. Think about it, though. Other people's mom sucking dick on the side, though. So, like, I, I'd rather do that instead of have my mom doing that, though, right? But you said she she has enough money. You understand? But you said she has enough money. But when I said she has enough money, bro, I said she has enough money to pay her bills, bro. Nothing extra, bro. You, no, and you said that should be enough. So why would she have to go suck some D on the side? No, I'm just saying, like, other people have their mom sucking dick on the side for some money. But she don't need it. No, I'm just saying, you try to make it seem like, 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 like you try to make something what I was doing while I was 13 was bad. It is. You never make money before? You never, like... No, I, I didn't, I didn't, uh... I wasn't an entrepreneur at 13. So, so, so I have a question, though. So, like, how, when you got your first girlfriend... When did I have my first girlfriend? Yeah. Do you see that I'm fat and short? I didn't have no <laughs> girlfriends back then. Okay, so so you want to understand though? You think about the money didn't go through my mom. You go through the girl too. I understand. Your girl? You have a girlfriend right now? No. So why do you even bring that up? No, I'm just saying, like, like, like you think you, I'm not I, the whole money didn't go through to my mom. Some of the money went to the girl. It went to a little. My, well, it's not a little girl to you, but to me, hey, wait, it wait, was wait, a little girl. No, no, no. I said for me, it would be a little girl, not for you. Okay. okay. So you were providing for a what, fifteen-year-old person, and yeah, you get a little nail. What do you do? Works with... to get their nail done at fifteen? Okay. For what? And and she left you anyway. So what was the purpose? <laughs> to get. Bro, I, I, bro, I'm not going to tell parents I tell my business out, out on the chat shit, bro. It's like, you know, what's up with that, though? You understand? That she left you? No, no, no. You know what's the reason why, though? Like, you understand? Like, like No, I know what it's like to provide for a wife. I, I, I don't... No, it's, not, it's, it's not about that, though. But you know what I want, though. So. Oh. Okay, you understand that? That's, so, like, the that's purpose even... of the nails done so I can get what You understand? Yeah, that's sad. How's that, how's that sad? Because <laughs> she left you anyway, so you got nothing. But I did, I did, though. I got the, what's name? You know what? Oh, wow. Congratulations. 
You have to get, you have to go pay her to do that. You know what they call those? You know what they call those? But how's that pay you, bro? Nigga, nigga, you pay for pussy too, bro. Come on, bro. Like, no, no, no. If that chat said any shit, no, no, no. Let me talk. Yo, chat, bro. If you say some shit about me, bro, y'all pay for pussy too, bro. Like, don't lie. Y'all took a bitch out to dinner, bro. Y'all pay for that shit too. You too, bro. Don't cap. No, not me. You never pay for pussy though? So you have a wife right now? So you never took her to dinner? You never took her to dinner? I am married. So you pay for the ring, pay for the ceremony, bro. Do you think me paying for the ring is me getting my interaction out of her? You know she's my wife, right? She's not a girlfriend like yours was. Okay, so you say the difference. You fucked her though. You have a son, nigga. You fucked her though. You know what happened, my son? What? He passed away. All right, I'm sorry for the loss, bro. I'm sorry, sorry. I'm just saying. My point is being is that me being a man, right, and you talking to me the way you're talking right now, if my son had told me what you told me right now, that you was out on the streets being an entrepreneur, you, how do you think that would – I would just want to be true. Do you think that's how your father – you think your father would be proud of what you're doing? Nate, then, bro, then, uh, I'm, I'm providing for my mom. I'm doing nah, that's not what I asked. I, I, is your, would your father be proud of you? Do you think so, that at yeah. least? Do you I talk to him? So. Huh? Do you visit him at jail? Well, I call that nigga. I call him on the phone. Oh, you call him? Yeah, what when, when they call him? You can call him in prison right now? Yeah, he got a little phone. Yeah, let me hear him. All right, bro. Like, if he actually answer. <laughs> like, niggas be wildin', bro. I mean, I want to I wanna hear this from a father's perspective. This would be excellent if he picks up. <laughs> I mean, he, he might be asleep. I don't know. Yo, yo, Joe, yo, Joe, bro, tell this nigga, bro. Wait, 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 wait. You call your dad Joe? <laughs> yeah. Yo, Joe, what's up, nigga? Is that his name? Yeah. Okay, this is an interesting. Look, look, he's on the phone for real. I can't see, man. Hold on, bro. If you Where show me a screen up, on a screen, it's just gonna be bright. <laughs> bro, okay, so what's up? We want to ask him, bro. You do want to ask him something? No, can, no. Hold on. Let me let me talk to him. Can you hear me, sir? Yes. I said, can he hear? Yeah. Uh, so currently, I'm speaking with your son. Do you know what your son does right now? No. Do you know how he makes money? Bro, bro, was, why are you stitching, nigga? This is stitching. No. Okay. I'm, not Yo, saying, I'm pretty, asking bro. him a question. So currently, um, where are you at currently? In Canada. On the streets, free or? No, I'm housed up somewhere. You behind bars? Not right now. So you're walking freely um, amongst Canada. <laughs> I'm just yeah. trying to understand because your your son has told me something different. I'm trying to understand. Bro, bro, bro. This man want to talk to you, bro. Like, like, I don't understand why he want to talk to you so badly. No, you're now sounding like I'm confused now. You said your father wasn't walking around freely. Is he or is he not? Bro, aren't you free, nigga? I'm free right now. Yeah, and you're free. Okay, so you're in New York. Your father's in Canada. May, may I ask you a question, sir? You and your ex-wife, why are y'all not together? <laughs> what do you mean what I mean uh, apparently it's just your son and your wife out here are you providing any funds or bro bro they call him Joe from the set bro from I don't care uh, I'm no, asking no, him no, a... right now I'm not providing funds you do make a point this don't sound like your father that's my that's my papa that, right? sounds, that's, my papa. that sounds like a 50 year old child <laughs> yo 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 Joe Joe aren't you my papa No. Nah, I mean, no. That's your exactly. papa. That is not your father. It's his though. How's it going? Is that... nah, I'm like the big man. He's you see that? What kind of grown man would talk like that? <laughs> Bro, how do you how do you? Me? Yeah, okay, yeah. That sounds like a clown. 
<laughs> yo, yo, he just call you a clown. Don't let him talk to you like that. Bro, bro say something back, bro. Don't let him talk. Don't, bro, look at this nigga. Bro, don't let him talk to you like that. Look at him. <laughs> bro, he said, bro, this nigga was, bro, he was, bro, he was talking to me, right? The way you're talking. I don't make no money, though. He said, I don't make no money, bro. He was trolling me, bro. <laughs> Right. I didn't say you don't make no money. I said the way you make money is a joke. He said the way I make money was bad, bro. But look at this nigga. Bro. Well, no, no, no. Tell him the whole story. Why do I think it's bad? But look at this nigga, bro. No. Get on this nigga. No, bro. Don't get on this nigga. To ask him why do I think it's bad? What you say? No. Tell him why I think it's bad. I want to hear what he has to say. Does but he Joe, sell? Joe, nigga, Joe. He said the way that I make money is bad by selling dope, nigga. No, selling poison to your brothers. Selling poison to my brothers. Is that bad? I mean... And thank you. And thank you. And thank you. That's all I need to hear. He already knows. But he hopefully that's that, a good bro. friend of yours. Because he knows that's bad. But Joe, is, is what I'm doing bad? You don't you be smoking splits too, bro. Stop capping. But Joe, do you like weed? Wait See? a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. You told me I was being a fed, but you just told me what you sell. Well, no, I didn't, though. I said, Joe, do you like weed? Why would you say that? I'm, not, I'm just asking a question. Why would you mention that drug, though, in, instead of any... You didn't say... You didn't say... But, but, but isn't weed the most common drug, though? You didn't say Britney... Huh? Yeah. Like I, I, leave, I said it twice though. I said, "Are you smoking spliffs?" I said, "Are you smoking weed?" You said, "In you, sm you said you smoke spliffs too." You know that? No, I didn't. I, and I said, "I know you be smoking spliffs." Man, are you trying to tell me out here you you out here uh, selling lettuce for hamburgers? But Joe, Joe, didn't I say you were smoking spliffs? Are you telling me you sell lettuce for hamburgers? I was on the island smoking spliffs. Bro, he was on the island with KK though. Tell him. I was on the island with KK. Yeah, with Cape, no Cape Flock. Look him up. Look him Cape Flock. He was on an island with him yeah. like five months ago. I don't even know who that is. But look that nigga Cape Flock up. <laughs> I don't know who that is. But the, the big Flocker? I don't know who Flocker yeah, is. That's that's, that's that KK Big Man's. I don't know who that is. How many times I gotta tell you that? But can you type him up though? Hold on, put on Cape Flock real quick. Yeah, put on Cape Flock. Like he was on the island with that nigga like five months ago. Uh, what does that mean? He was on the island, bro. Rikers. He was on Rikers with that nigga. Rikers Island. Yeah. Doing what? Bro, he was with Cape Flock. Because he was he had a charge, right? Are y'all hearing this, guys? This man is proud of another <laughs> man being locked up with another man. <laughs> bro, bro, it's a, it's a free flocker, though. It's a free flocker. Free, free flocker, though. Free K -K -K. That, that, and that's where we are. We have black men who are proud to be locked up with other black men. Yo, say free, free my nigga Gotti, free Oppie for all them niggas, bro. How free about you free... Oppie. Why can't you free yourself from this life? Yo, free, I'll be blue, nigga. What do you mean? Yeah. Look at you. Right, have you been Have you been on the <laughs> lettuce tonight? Have you been on the spliffs? <laughs> no, I'm, just, I'm chilling, bro. I'm chilling. I'm chilling, nigga. <laughs> yo, yo. But I think about it, though. Look up K Flock, though. He's lit. I'm not looking up nobody. So, so I have a question, though. Can't she at least say Freak Flocker? No. But he's innocent, though. He's innocent, though. On a weird shit. Uh. But he has self defense charge, bro. He's innocent. So I don't know him. But free, but free, but he's, why do you he's just a, say he's a free? Black nigga. Fellow black man. No, no. I want to free you. Free fuck. Free fuck. I, that's all I've been trying to do today is just get you to get a better life. Yeah, yeah I, I understand though. But but I never went to Rikers though. I, I went to Juvie like one time, bro. Yeah, and you see, fellas, already been locked up. Yeah. <laughs> But like, I was, but like, think about it though. It was harassing for the NYPD though, so it was, it was okay. You just gonna keep blaming the cops. You never blame but yourself. They, never take they, accountability. They harassed me though. They harassed me though. But you don't know the situation. They really harassed me. They target me specifically, bro. Like they knew on my dick for no reason. Yep, that's what they do. They just find some random black guy. Bro, I was just chilling, bro. I was walking down my block, and then boom, two two big ass officers on my dick, bro. Every day. Yeah, bro, come on. Like, you understand How does he know? He's from Canada. <laughs> bro, he used to live in New York, bro. He used to live in the South. Yeah. Are you an entrepreneur? <laughs> yeah, is he a snitch? On the streets, yeah. Oh, is he? Look at me. Are you proud of that? <laughs> um, I mean, if I can... 
He's smoking a spliff right now, though. He really smoking a spliff right now, though. I, I, I don't guess care. He, what does he do for a living? What we do for a living, bro? Fuck shit over. Yes, sir. He raised hell, bro. Is that joke from the Sev. So he's 17, too, I'm guessing? 18? Nah, he like 20 something. 20 years old. And he ain't doing nothing how with his you, life. Bro? How old are you? I don't know how old are you, bro. Nah, he's like, yeah, 20 something, bro. Are you doing anything with your life or? <laughs> he smoked his fist, nigga. What do you mean? Smoking, smoking dead off. Oh, he's the house. Yo, he's he smoking the house. See, he saved himself. Why do you find that so hilarious? I don't get fuck the ops, though. Fuck the ops, bro. Fuck the cops. Fuck the ops, bro. And this is where our black men are today. Like, he, this man can't tell me he has a job. He's talking about dead ops. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? This nigga funny as shit, though. Yo, he's he smoking a slip, bro. I know, it's fun, it, I know. It's funny to you. I know it's funny to you. I'm just tired of seeing black men dead on the streets, but it is what it is. Right, but I like, think about it. This is Joe from the set. He never laughed, though. He from the set. I don't care that he's part of some set. He from the set. That Joe from the set. KK Big Man's. You keep saying KK Big Man like that matters to me. K Flock Big Man. Look up K Flock. No, I don't. But can you look that nigga up real quick? Why? Man? What, what am I gonna know? What am I gonna learn about him? Bro, you gonna learn he's an in, bro, bro. Free I'm gonna learn he's an. What am I gonna learn? He's an inmate. Wow, that's that's cool. Bro, bro. Okay, tell the chat this: free Oppie Blue, free Guy Blue, bro. All them niggas innocent, bro. They, yeah. they fuck NYPD. You say, yeah. say free Oppie, nigga. Yeah. So I'm gonna ask this one more time. What does that young man do for a living? Does he have a job? What would you do for a living, baby boy? Bro, I'm fucking be staying fucking high. That's what I do. Are you proud of that? Yeah. And that and that's all I need to hear. See, that I'm glad I was able to talk to you tonight, man. Even though I understand you're young, so I'm not really pushing that hard. I really hope I don't read about you here in a few years. Bro, he said I'm gonna get packed. Yo, he said I'm gonna get packed, bro. That's disrespectful. You think a nigga gonna pack me though? I never lack with no vest. Stop playing with me. You're just another black man right now. But but, 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 but I think, but you think I lack though. Niggas think I lack, bro. Who won't who, who won't touch me? You think you're the only black man to say that? Well, I, I know that though. But who touched me though? I don't know who's gonna touch you. It's not even gonna matter. Your name's not gonna matter. You'll just be another another bro, obituary. Bro, your name is beef, bro. No zero. Op zero, bro. You see, guys, and this is all it's about. Four years in the beef, the being in a gang and being in New York. And four years in, but tell them, tell them though. Four years in the beef, the op zero. We don't care about you being in a gang. I'm, I'm, I'm just saying, like, like you saying that like, niggas gonna touch me, they gonna do harm to me. Absolutely. But I've been in the four years though. You're not new. You're not. The, you're not gonna be the first black man to die. But I know that I, I know I have little niggas that die in this for this shit, bro. I, I, I know that, bro. I already know this already, man. You gotta understand that. Okay. Why do you have to make yourself next? Why did your mama have to read about you in the obituaries? That's all I'm trying to say. Bro, that's not going to happen, though, bro. That's, you're not the first black bro. man to say that. Bro, it's not going to happen, bro. Don't wish bad on no one, bro. You I understand no, that. I, I tried to wish good on you. You wish bad on yourself. No, I'm just saying, like, I'm just saying, like, you, you talk to me like, like I'm, a, I'm a rookie, though. Talk you are. Like rookie, bro. It, How? Bro, bro, anybody can walk up on you. I don't know why you think you're invincible. I'm not smart though. I'm not, I'm not on moonlight on damn duck. Nigga. The cops, <laughs> the cops literally walked up on you, threw you in jail. Somebody can walk up on you. The juvie, but, but think about it, think about it. The, the conviction got overturned because it was harassment. Cops. That's what you're happy with. All right, young man. Okay. I'm hoping it works out for you. But, but not but this. The, but not this. But the, the, the conviction got overturned though. The juvie charge got overturned. Because right, listen, right. they, they, they proved that the cops were harassing me and my friend. Why are you Cause saying that? Because no, there was no reason for them to stop us, though. Why are you saying that to be like you still ain't like living that script. life? Why are you talking to me like you ain't living that life, talking about dead ops? Because fuck the ops, nigga. Like, what exactly. You and they're going to say the same thing about no, you. No, but, what, but what do you mean, though? They say the same thing about you. No, they don't, though. Huh? They won't? They don't do nothing. The Once do again, nothing. I'm gonna ask you one. I'm gonna ask you this one more time, just so we can yo, yo. figure this out. Why do you think you're the lucky one? Oh, because think about it. I'm the main character in this shit, though. You understand that? Thank you, thank, thank you. I'm so glad you said that. Thank you for that. Exactly. You think you're the main character. You think you're invincible. I am so glad you said that. You know what? This has been an excellent talk. I'm so glad I got on here tonight because you are exactly who I needed to talk to. Exactly. 
brother, I really wish you the best. Get out of this fucking life because it's ridiculous. But I wish you the best, all right? Hold on. Bro, bro tell your chat to look me on right, bro. Bro, I made a nigga run, bro. It's just a whole video of me making a nigga run, bro. Look me on Reddit. Bro, I mean nasty run, bro. I mean that's serious. Fuck nasty, bro. Bro, right. this is whole, but look me up on Reddit. But tell your chat, look me up. No.